Good morning, folks. Good morning, Aura. Ow. Good morning, Xandrabot. Beep. And good morning, Favicon this isn't no. Good morning, Mega Man. Let's go back to Indonesia. Oh no! <laughs> Xandrabot. <laughs> Sam, this is no good morning. This is a no good morning. Hey, there we go, there we go. We're good. So we have uh, Sarah Brightman. You know, I never noticed this before, but Brightman is making like a whoa face. Brightman is like, wait, Dr. C? Who's Dr. C? <laughs> Dual Man is like, it's on the box, you utter... Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. <laughs> Ringman is just, like, doing his best to pose for the picture. Let's go say hi to Ringman. You know what? Let's go say hi to Commitment Man. I mean, honestly, he looks like one of those rings you blow bubbles through. Mm. Like, like, you dip him in one of those solutions, and then you blow bubbles out of him. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you take Ringman, like, bloop. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. Um, Karan, this is absolutely set in, in, in <clears throat> Indonesia. It's based by, by an Indonesian developer a few years ago. It's really interesting. There's like a bunch of these games, and we're going to be playing the uh, latter trilogy for now. Whoa! What is going on with this one? It's a super bad. Yeah! Viral Wizard! That was wild! <gasps> it's a face of me! I think you can slide over that gap. Sure can! Ah! Oh no! I've set myself up for danger. <laughs> Aha! Okay, rod of danger. Sort of. No! <laughs> I have just coiled. Royal Blue, yes. Not only did Xander beat the successfully unreasonable hack, but towards the end it just sort of became vanilla Mega Man. Yeah. Like, they just sort of they just sort of gave up. Oh right, I can't. Just left. Alright, cool, yeah, just leave. It's fine by me. What if everyone just Got washed away by the rain. That's what happens to you. Right, right, there's a... Uh... We can't... We can't. We can't keep going. We can't go to the Dr. Cossack stages before we get the balloon and the wire. Yeah, I... I, I... You know, I, I beat the uh, unreasonable hack because, hi, it's me. This is what I do. I'm stubborn. <laughs> uh, for the record, yes, Barry, uh, this hack is very reasonable. We haven't had almost any major issues with it, have we? Yeah, it's really nice. Like, this has been smooth sailing and quite fun, actually. Mm. No! Crap, okay. Um... <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I I appreciate the game says no no take it take it take it all oh, right no okay yeah you don't you don't got this turned out. <laughs> for a brief moment though reach out for that platform and then but yeah for peeps asking uh, so this rom hack comes very heavily recommended apparently yep got um, rave reviews so we're we're finishing off the rom hack set. Of Mega Man games with these because they're apparently very good. Yeah. When I say these, I mean this game and its two sequel ROM hacks. Yep, yep. There's this is after in Indonesia. This is uh, following another ROM hack from the same author that was removed that took place in the Java Island. Uh, and this there's after in Indonesia. Uh, Doctor Wily visits Indonesia because apparently stuff like this like puts Doctor Wily onto like some some dastardly plan. And then the last one is Indonesian artifact. It's apparently really, really interesting. I assume it's four, five, and six for each of those rom hacks. It's actually four, three, and five. Wow. Yeah, it's neat. Oh. 
Yeah, there we go. So, and also, oh right, I still haven't done this today. Oh, this is what I want to do today. I want to set up a little tracker so I can uh, have folks um, help decide what is going on. Oh right. So I can have folks help decide uh, if I will play at the, at the end of the ROM pack section uh, the uh, Xandra specific cursed Mega Man double jump. What is this weird hypno hippo? I know, no, I know, I, I like, I like the hypno hippo, the hypno po. Another one? Alright, I need to find something. Oh, heck yeah! Let's go! Let's just do this. Oh, you can destroy the pedestal. Yep. Or you can just murder. Yeah, what if I just did that? <laughs> Hippo Space Outlaw is pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> I need to play it this without logic. Me really too! Really I mean, it's, it's, yeah, it's, 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 it's a Jay Dolan jam, so it's gotta be good. But yes, I hear really good things about it. I've, oh! had, I've had several friends rave to me about, about that game. Liz, Liz runs it. Nice. Liz That's is probably, funny. I think Liz might just might be, but might, might just have the world record in Hypno Space Outlaw speedrunning. I did not know that game was speedrunning. Oh. Everything is speedrunnable. If you're not a coward, I, I'm not sure that that's true. That's, I mean, I'm also not sure being a coward has anything to do with it. Thank you! Oh, I'm in a very precarious position. Oh no! Oh, I forgot about this. Dang it. Whee! Whee! Oh, oh my god! That collision was a little risky there. Yeah. Probably was meant to jump before. Yep. No! <laughs> we got save states. We got save states. Cause we're out here to have a good time. Um, I keep okay. I need to jump onto that platform with confidence. There we go. Hey. All right, let's go. Let's see what Brightman's all about. Liz has two of the three. Liz has two of the three world records in Hypno Space Alpha. Okay, what if we washed out Ringman? Watch, watch that jewelry. Nope, does absolutely nothing. What if we threw that uh, ring into the garbage compactor? Nope. What if... No, that is... No? Not Pharaoh at all. What if we just shot missiles at the ring? Ring man's fast, I guess. This is just like, seek him out. No, absolutely not. Skulls? Are you scared of... Yeah, you're scared of death. You good old scared to death. Weakness. I might want to use that E-Tank. Uh, yeah. Ringman is a tough customer. Okay, maybe I'm a little bit too aggro here. I have a lot of this shield. Can you shoot shield. this whole shield the way you can with the shield? No. That sucks. Why are they keeping a terrible shield weapon in this series? That's a good question! Terrible weapons in Mega Man 11, or were they all good? I can't remember. I need to replay that. They're game. really interesting weapons. They're really cool. Mer. Oh, this is actually super easy if you're not constantly aggro. <laughs> I just need to time my jumps, and then I'm good. I get it now.
Yeah! Easy peasy. After dying three times, easy peasy! Hey! Super! <gasps> Thanks, Chiron! <laughs> well, we can't have Popeye references and everything, Popeye Otaku. Ring Boomerang! Ring and? No, nothing. Just, that, that's it. That's all. That's all I got. Uh, remember those passwords? Did you ever enter those back in the day? Oh yeah, I would like draw them. Like, and... Yeah, I would draw them too. <laughs> They're not a thing anymore. Yep. Although I guess it was useful for being a transplantable save file. You never needed to worry about putting it on the true. device or whatever. Now Woo! Days, oh, that was a great wiggle. <laughs> nowadays it seems like a lot of people are locking down saves so you can't even transfer them around. Which yeah, is, which it's is rude. I feel like I kind of low key feel like achievements I, ruined. Look! Look at the wiggle! Look at the wiggle! Whoa, 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 whoa. Isn't that great? I'm sorry, I'm sorry, please continue. I just kind of feel like achievements ruin the transmissibility of save files because oh. all of a sudden developers care way too much about their achievability rules. I'm so glad the Switch doesn't have achievements. I fell out of love with achievements. Like, my first, like, big, like, when I got into the games industry, after, like, so many years of indie development, uh, my first, like, dream was, oh, I want to, like, write the achievement list for a game. And that was, like, my big dream, and I got to do it, and then... Now I super don't care about achievements. I, I feel like, I mean, god, it's funny because I feel like that, I feel like this philosophy has affected even developers who don't have achievements because if you look at, like, the new Animal Crossing, where for some reason you can only have one save file per console and it is non-transferable for no reason. Yeah, that's messed up. And I, if, if something happens to your, uh, to your Switch, like, all right, fine. If something happens to your Switch, just tell us and we'll change it once. After that, never again. If someone happens to like, I don't know, throw your switch in the lake twice, you're out of luck, buddy. Play the game again. Uh, it's just really cool. I don't like. I don't like how developers approach like <laughs> ownership great. as a concept. Yeah. Oh yeah, those are fun. Oh really, Papa? How so? What? I'm sorry, I got a little bit exploded. Generally speaking, Chiron, I only get a lot of getting achievements in games if I think the achievement will lead to some sort of interesting experience I didn't already have. Mm. Like, there are some games where achievements hint at gameplay that you might not have known about, and I appreciate that, although I think it could be done in better ways than via achievements. Um, but I, I'm, okay, I'm more okay with that than I am with, like, no. Here's, here's some boring completionist bullshit. Yeah, I mean, I used to be a big time achievement fiend. Like, I got all the achievements in uh, Dead Rising on the on the 360. And that has some, like, ones that put the life of the console in jeopardy. Oh, no. Yeah, like, you had to keep that game running for, like, two or three days straight. But that reminds me of... Uh, what was it? It's the original Stanley Parable, or sorry, the remake. Uh, there was an achievement on Steam for not playing the game for seven years. Yeah! Oh, I should get that. I probably <laughs> have that now. Yeah, I know, right? Uh, fun fact. Dungeons of Dreadmore had a special achievement for meeting the developers. Almost no one ever got it. Not just because few people met the developers, but because people kept forgetting to give the achievements out in the development team. No! <laughs> yeah. So, 90% of people, like, like the, the vast majority of people who you see attributed to having that achievement on Steam are people who used, like, like hacks, basically. Um, but honestly, who cares? Like, can, we didn't care. Can you... Is it too late to get one of those, or like? I, I never had the ability to give it to people. I don't, I'm not, like, not part of the Gaslight like, Steamworks thing. Also, I don't even know who, if anybody, even has those permissions anymore. It would probably be, like, one of the old owners of the company who aren't working at that company anymore who don't exist anymore. Mm. Um, who knows? I mean, it's funny because I remember us talking about it internally, and the philosophy was very much, well... <laughs> We, the, we came to a tacit agreement that, that anybody who got really upset at the idea of a game with an achievement they couldn't get, we were fine with them being upset. <laughs> like, 
Sometimes you're just fine with people. But, 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 what, what the heck happened there? Like. There was definitely a very low key, like, deal with it mentality mm. about achievements. Yeah, That's at the end, end of the day, they, these are just the cheap. What if I. Okay, what if I. What if I just. Yep, nope, gotcha. I, I knew it, knew it that time. Arg! Okay. This is a little rude, this level. Yeah, I think I'm in an alternate path or something. What? Hey, Rush, don't just. Rush was teleported away. Maybe don't. These rocks are just. Oh, God. These are very rude rocks. Rude rocks. Ro yeah, I was, I was trying to find one, but I couldn't. Ugh! Nuts to me. Hi, Ryu. Oh! Did- no. Well! Oh, you must keep this hell! Oh! Ah! Oh no! <laughs> oh! <laughs> that was- Woo. that was extremely clutch. Wow. <laughs> like... Oh my god, emergency maneuvers, that JPEG. Yeah, no. I guess this is the intended path. Wild. Confused shrug. Oh, okay. Yeah, the Dead Rising, that was that was a tricky thing to I have hundred percent also um Mirror's Edge and I had a lot of fun nice with that one. Job. Aw, thank you for the host. What? What is that? Yeah, that's kind of funny. Is it just me or are those Mario blocks? They, they are absolutely are Mario blocks. That's why I said it's kind of funny. That's very silly. Yes, Mirror's Edge is so good! I miss Mirror's Edge. Mm -hmm. I'm like the one person who really liked uh, Mirror's Edge Catalyst. I never did play that. It has its flaws. In particular, the world design suffers from the fact that they have to bottleneck you for loading purposes. Uh, and it's not, it's not great if you are the sort of person who gets lost easily. Um, because you will find, uh, you will, you will find yourself frequently having problems navigating. However, uh, if you are me and really good at memorizing area layouts, it's a really fun game. Mm. Um, I don't know. I I recognize that game has flaws, but it's the kind of game that has flaws and I love it. I love it anyway. Like, I there's a lot of flawed games that I really deeply love, and Catalyst is one of those games. Um, Ring, you're very you're you're not helping at all here. <laughs> Yeah, this is not going well. Okay. What if what if garbage? What if compost? But yeah, kind of list from what I'm aware reviewed poorly and it's sold poorly, so I think Gears mm. Edge is done for a while, if not forever. Yeah. Uh, it's a pity because no one else really has ever tried doing what that game did. Mm. Like, why does the ring do that? I don't know! It it seems funny at the time, but now it's really giving me trouble. <laughs> Very hesitant ring. Yeah. Oh, come on. <laughs> oh, you just using pause to erase it? That's really yeah. smart. Dang, Xander here with the strats. Dang it. Oh, so it's close. really close. <laughs> what if garbage? Yeah, Ring actually, uh, so that's something I learned from the uh, race that was a GDQ. Rings, uh, all the weapons have one pixel of hit hitbox. The enemy's hitbox is the big one. So with the ring, you have to absolutely shoot it directly nice. through the enemy. 
or else it doesn't work. Yeah! Super! Super indie! Oh, thank you, Karan! Mm. Another robot master defeated. Another drill bomb. Drill bomb! <gasps> what? Oh, jet? Yeah. yeah! Finally! Bye, Popeye! After that, we just gotta figure out where the heck wire and balloon are. Yeah. Oh, I remember this music. Ba -da -da. Ah! Hello. Alright. Oh, yeah, I can. Oh, wow, the explosions are kind of big. That was a spike? That was a spike. Did you know that was a spike? I didn't. Just gonna, just gonna restart real quick. Game over. Hmm. There we go. All good. I do like drill though. Um. Okay. I keep forgetting about that spike. I just can't see that spike. Is there another weapon that's... Yeah. I guess this game doesn't have, like, uh... What about garbage? Nope. Yeah, this, I guess Buster. Like, you, you, you have Mega Buster, you should probably use the Mega Buster. Yep, if only I had my good buddy Drush Jet. Yeah, no, buddy. Goodbye. Okay. Um. Fine. I will receive your punishment. No! What are you doing? Okay, okay, we did it, we did it, folks. Let's never do that again. I think always so celebratory when he jumps. Ah! Wait, is there, is there, is there something over there? Alright, fine, fine, I'll destroy you all. See? That's what you want. Alright, um... Is there... Okay, I want to see if there's something over here. Nah, okay, no. Not really. Whoa, okay. There's going to be like flickering gumball machines. Flickering gumballs! I wonder if some of these larger enemies are made of a multiple cool sprites. I think they have to. Isn't there some sort of limit? Or was that only on the Game Boy? I think there are reasons, technically speaking, uh, to to separate up large sprites into multiple pieces, but I couldn't tell you the exact details. Mm. What Mega Man game is this for? Yeah. Let me look up this game on the TCR after fun. What am I playing for? Too bad that I probably won't be here when you uh, when you're doing uh, the ZX and the Zero series, because it's fun to look those up. I mean, you can you can watch. Oh, right, you'll be on. I'll be on. I'll be on West Coast time, which means I'll probably be asleep when you do these. Yeah, games. that's fair. We're just waking up. Best part of waking up is good morning, Mega Man. Oh, maybe God with the balloon. I need to find out where the balloon is. Today on what if we didn't? There we go. Huh. 
there's a bunch of unused sprites in this game. Are there? Is, is there? Yep. There's some remnant sprites from a giant Sphinx mini-boss that was going to be in Pharaoh stage. Oh, oh, you're looking at uh, Cunning Room floor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, there was a seal robot in Dive Man stage that appeared to have been unused. Um, a weird a weird platform that raises up when you shoot it. Um, a black and white gun on wheels looks like it might have been from a Game Boy one. Huh. Uh, sprites of Dr. Wily and Dr. Cossack pointing, which are unused. I assume for dialogue of some kind. Oh, we don't we don't need platforms anymore, I guess. Ah, oh, okay, good. <laughs> uh, yeah, bunch of random stuff. Okay. Hey, we made it. Another one of these. Okay. All right, boss. What's up? We're gonna just look at random Mega Man games for interesting stuff on PCRF. That way, I can like entertain people. Nope. Chad is asking, what do you think the game is? I'd say battery acid. Yeah, no, that's that's the one. That's that's the. Huh? Did you know Mega Man Three has a bunch of cheats that you can activate without almost any work, just by plugging in a second controller? Is it really? Yes, Mega Man Three. Um, if you hold right to control the second controller, Mega Man jumps super high. You hold up, the game slows down, and if you hold up and A, um, animation logic timer is frozen. This is Mega Man 3, not 4. Hello, Dido! Bon matin! Mm. Mom's here. Hi! That's really interesting, actually. They just Super. forgot to remove those debug commands. Ooh! Okay, Plan says Mega Man is inspired by solar energy. So, e tanks probably taste like sunflower. <laughs> Alright, Dr. Cossack time, but I can't. I got to find the items. Does anyone know where the items are? Can look it up? Please. I combed through Dive Man stage pretty well. The last few, I'm pretty sure, kind of like alternate paths. It's been a while since I've been to Dust Man. Initially, like, gosh, where were they in Vanilla? I think one of them was in Spellman. Let's see. Hmm. What even was Ferriman? Right, oh right, Ferriman stage was weird. Dive Man and Ferriman. It is. Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna check out Pharaoh Man, because I remember Pharaoh Man's stage has some wild geometry. There's no guides for this or anything, sadly. Is there a long play? Uh there is, but uh, there's a stream of someone racing it, but they missed the optional items. Oh. Or skipped it intentionally. Yeah, or maybe they're just not there. Maybe they don't exist. That's possible actually. There it is. Aha! Oh. Okay. It was the pits. <laughs> Super. However, this long play is also an hour long, so it's going to be hard to find out exactly where the items are. Mm. Oh, we did it. Uh, which one are you missing? Balloon? Balloon! Okay, Balloon is in the first four minutes somewhere, but I caught the pausing. Oh. Uh, 
Just tell me the stage. Um, it's you're not gonna find it unless you're doing a little bit of trial and error. Okay, well then I wanna, I, wanna, I still wanna, I still wanna chance. It's, it's bright man stage. Bright man, really? Okay. Yeah. It's bright. Okay, cool. That'll save some time. Yeah, th this would have been very hard to find without a guide. Nice. I think. Do we need a special item to get it? Alright, cool. Is it hidden in the block? Requires you to be somewhat suicidal. Figures! <laughs> Y'all yeah, get that E tank again, why not? How come there's no light here? They're, they're, they got little flashies, why is there no light? I hesitated when I first saw that hole, like, oh, wait, I wonder, there's probably something in here. Yay! Sick go, Carol Kyron. Wizard! Thank you! Thank you, Chiron! Mm -hmm. Alright, now let's just get the heck out, I guess. Whee! There's no way to exit, so I'll just exit manually. Uh, they really should. Yep. Mega Man Dexter. Yeah. Oh yeah, Mega Man Dexter. Weird, very, very strange crossover. This is making me want to play Mega Man 11 again for some reason. It's so good. It's so Mega good. Man 11 is so good. One of my favorites. Except for Acid Man stage, I hate that stage. Yeah, fair enough. But all the rest of them really good. Bum, ba, da, 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 dum, ba, 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 ba. I love that Doctor Gossack just had a castle and said like. Yeah, okay, I'll build some turrets. A couple, Just a couple in the back. Just, yeah, just don't, please don't mess up <laughs> the architecture. Just, I'll just, yeah. Bye, Chiron, thank you. Yes, Dr. Casa, the real villain. For sure, we will, we will win the day here. What's bright me? Right? Yep, just a regular freeze. We got drill, we got, oh, none of these weapons are super exciting. Ah! Ah, thank you so much, Monks Rats! Aww. Thank you! Monks Rats. Yeah! <laughs> that's, that's what I would say, right? Yep. Oh, I'm excited. We are playing Mega Man 4 after in Indonesia as part of the Good Morning Mega Man Intermission Tour. Soon we'll get back to Mega Man Zero. One day. But first, we got a bunch of ROM packs to go through. On my quest to play every single Mega Man game ever made. I still can't believe you actually ended up going through the entire series. Yeah, it's... it exists! <laughs> it was a game! I, I really like Mega Man X4. Love that game to bits. 
You know, I will say this. I think X8 was the least offensive of the 3D ones. Yeah, no, X8 was like, all right. It was it was a, a, a good, like, reward for making it through X6 through X8. 7 was the worst. Yeah, five, 5 was okay. A bit of a letdown. Like, I'm gonna say X6 and X7 are the worst, but X7 is... They're, they're bad for different reasons. X6 is unreasonably hard. X7 is unreasonably grimy. <laughs> oh, do they make the balloons disappear way fast? Very fast. Like, yeah, like, like... God... Burn! 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 <laughs> Why did they make me? <laughs> to be fair... Uh... That was... Capcom was struggling with the Mega Man yeah. series as a whole a lot around then. Which is why they stopped making them. Yeah, sometimes you just stop making them. Yep, and then you make a jillion dollars on Monster Hunter instead. Right, that's what Capcom's been up to. Yes, Monster Hunter has been Capcom's primary money maker since around the Wii days, if mm -hmm. not earlier. It is fully supplanted Mega Man as their primary franchise. Mega Man has been supplanted. Yeah. That reminds me, I really need to go back and finish playing um, Monster Hunter Stories, which is their uh, Pokemon spin-off, where you get to capture the monsters yes! and your Pokemon Oh, friends. I remember, I remember you. I really like that game. It's actually quite fun. Um, I guess I don't have to destroy the turrets. I can just go. Bye-bye. What if I just left? Oh no, you! The rudest. Rude Stomper! Hmm. Sometimes you're a laptop and you just want to go to sleep. And you do. Oh, waifu, yeah. Monster Hunter Stories is really cute. I mean, it's, it's very vapid in the way that all Monster Hunter games are. <laughs> like, the writing is not their strong point, but it's, it's really cute. Haha, right, but... <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see, what are we missing? Wait, hold on. Okay. Okay, the ladder keeps going up very high. Like you do. Yeah. Are you stuck? Did you saw block? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> okay, it goes really high. What is? Okay, I'm just gonna keep holding up. No. I don't know where this goes. Nowhere? Why why does the ladder go up so high? Oh, that's such a cute emote. Oh a laughing a laughing sloth. That's really good. God, yeah, speaking of Monster Hunter World, I really <laughs> it's really such a long want to play more I said I wanna play more Iceborne with you. Okay, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna save slot here. I just- I'm just so curious. It's just a ladder! It's just an infinite- why- why does it keep going up so high? It just keeps going and I'm still climbing now. To I this day, I'm still climbing. <laughs> they say Mega Man is still climbing that invisible ladder. <sighs> I guess it just keeps going. Alright, fine, I'll just- Jump off, I've jumped off now. Yeah! <laughs> this game is wild. Who's the first Cossack boss again? Right! You! Okay. Usually it's Ring. Maybe it's Ring still. What a weird beetle object. Oh, it is still Ring. Beetle object or Bob object. Yep. Aha! <laughs> what? Oh, okay. I did not get that reference, unfortunately. That's okay. Someone is that well. Eventually, Mega Man will climb back up from the bottom of the screen. Yes, <laughs> absolutely. Right, that's Cossack 1. Ooh, now 
we're into the castle. We have entered the castle. Why does this remind me of Nightman Station 6? It really oh, does! Valid. It was also in a castle. It's also pinkish, isn't it? Yep. I actually wanted to refill some of these weapons. Yeah, skull's pretty useful. There we go. All good. Speaking of skulls, oh, oh no, no, the mandatory rush jet section. It's the mandatory rush jet section. What is with Rumpax and mandatory rush jet section? They like them. I don't. What? Ah, yeah. Ah, well. No! Okay. Okay. We'll just have a do-over. It's fine. It's fine. We'll just do it over again. It's gotta be a little bit higher. Yeah, here we go! Okay! Woo! Okay. It's just a little bit... It's just a little bit of hell. It's fine. It's not. It's super... Okay, these... Spikes hurt a lot. Goodness. Wait, hold on. No. Okay. I, okay. Well, I tried. Okay. <laughs> okay. What a very excitable robot. Jet a little bit. There's something on the left. I. It's fine. We don't need it. Okay. Oh crap, no, no. Dang it. This one's rude. It is not garbage. It is drill. It is an E-Tank. I have six of them, I'm gonna use them. Yeah, that's legit. What a weird prank. Yep, this, this, the, the big weird box. Big, Always. You might get a little strange every now and then, but you're no match for big weird. Strangeness in the street. Okay, we're good, we're good. Take it, it's time, it's time. Woo! Thank yeah, you, yeah. explosion. Jeez, that flash is a little intense. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh, sorry about that. It's okay. <laughs> Dr. Kosick, why did you make this weird cube? Research. I don't know. I was, I was, I was doing some some stuff, I guess, and things got out of hand. And I figured, you know what? I could weaponize this, <laughs> but only if someone put a gun to my. Oh, okay, sure, fine. I'll weaponize it. I understand. Like Dr. Kosick is doing a lot of this under duress, but dude is very, very ready to just. Oh no, you've gone too far, Dr. Kosick. <laughs> Put an auto scroller. This ROM hack likes pixel perfect jumps a little more than I mean. Yeah. I guess we, we do we do have a lot of ways to circumvent it. What if we circumvent it? 
So balloon's a little bit tricky. Oh, okay. You place it a little bit under you, like forward but low, and it keeps going low because then it lets you do this very easily. Also, it stays for longer than it seems. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought... No, 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 clear, clearly. I'm sorry, yes. Fine, it's all good. Bye! Hopefully this is this will not turn into a wall of spikes. Nope, nope, just a happy stompy fella. I can't believe I managed to, to slide under that. That was great. Oh, I almost, almost got it. That would've been great. But I didn't. I want to do over. Is there, is there a way for me to do this, like, really cool strat? There is! There we go. Easy peasy. Nothing to it. Wall of spikes. As predicted, just not in the manner I figured it would show up. But still wall of spikes. I think, I think I have been vindicated in some manner. Can I just... Yeah. Nope. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, but then... Yes, I see. And then we balloon. Wait, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna call on my good buddy Rush here. Save states are great because they let me play this game and not been too long showing it off. Okay, we're good. We're also... We're... Hey! Hey, you're not supposed to shoot behind you. You're a forward-facing turret. What are you doing? <laughs> what the heck are you doing? Foul! Hey! No! Like... No! You're not su That's not how you work! <laughs> Absolutely not! I call foul. This game. Obviously, these turrets were never meant to be placed in a wall you could get behind. But it's just... Where are we? We ended up in another game. Okay, Rush Marine just does not want. Fine. We'll rush jet. Oh, it's not it's a horizon water. It's not even real water. It's just horizon water. No. Yeah. Ah, okay. I'm gonna take the high road. Oh, it's actually way too fast. Okay. Sometimes the high road is just way too fast. I got hit by the propeller. The propeller got me. I didn't even know that was possible. That thing has a hitbox. That is kind of amazing. Got it. All good. Oh, right. God, it's good to keep a shield on you at all times. Just in case, you know? Oh, that's maybe too much. Dang it! <laughs> At the last second, Dr. Cossack- Oh, right! Advertising! I gotta put my name out there. Oh, this thing! Is it still Pharaoh? 
Uh, kinda. Oh, Fairy was kinda just lagging behind me there. I'm dead, also. It's fine, we're just starting here. We got full health now! This is a weird pharaoh. Kind of into it. No, oh, you're very fast. Eh, yeah, probably. Right, yeah, that's right. Yeah, I, I love the, uh, yes. I, I love the idea that every time there's a there's a, a life that appears and then just falls in a pit. Like, somewhere down there on Earth, there's someone who's like, <laughs> just gets like a, a life up, but only as Mega Man. If they ever die, they will be reborn as Mega Man. Oh no! This is a terrible isekai. <laughs> Yeah, okay. I would, I, would, I would write that as a short thing. I'm kind of, no, no, I'm, I'm really... No! I'm really into the idea of, like, Isekai, but... Oh! Yes, okay. Thank you. that for the next person. Maybe I don't want it. That's what I keep telling myself. When do you want to order lunch for Oh yeah, we should probably look at that soon. I'm almost done uh, with this. Haha! <laughs> oh my gosh, we're Spider-Man. <laughs> That's really funny! Side rain, you know. Yeah, it's you know, indoor rain. Oh what? Oh Yeah. That's cute. You're cute. Oh, oh we're back in flashing sprites hell. A little bit of flicker. I No, no. It was it was a long shot. <laughs> Is this like an alternate path? I... Oh, you have to be standing to use the wire. I don't feel like this is a very useful ability. Well, you're, you're free to believe what you want, Aura, but I'm dead. Is the Why answer. are you? I'm just, okay. You're trying I'm, to get down the, the little side thingy? Yeah, I'm just really curious now. Um, I'm almost gonna say, okay, fair enough. Work. It is a secondary path. No, that's fair. Oh, nice to that jump. Mm.
There we go. Easy peasy. Please save. Fine, I'll save. No, E tank for me, yes. I do want that E tank. I'm kind of sad that Rush Marine doesn't appear even if there's no water. I just appreciate the idea of Rush Marine's like, DING! Like, nope, I'm on land! You call me on land! Just, just, I'm here! Let's go! This is probably the wonder that they didn't have a way to distinguish between actual water and non water. There's only be some merch screens and not some merch screens, right? Uh, oh, and this one maybe. Yeah. I'll just, I'll just tuck myself into this burner here. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for adding that quote. <laughs> I do not know if that goes high enough. Nope. It did not. That's awkward. Yep. Good thing you got balloon, huh? Mouse always finds the G's. <laughs> ah, G's. Found it! Did uh, that thing just clip through that wall? Sure did! Okay. Sometimes you just clip through a wall. Bye, weird thing. Oh, it's clipping through the wall again! That's actually bad. <laughs> Bye! Okay, we're not out of the woods. Nice. Did I just go through the metal helmet? Wow. I guess. Yeah, sure, why not? I'll take it. Are those spikes? Oh! <laughs> yes! They are really... <laughs> They are spikes! What do you know? <laughs> oh, what's happening now? Are those spikes explodes instantaneously? What? Oh, hey, Dr. Crossing. What's with the vibrating floor tile over there? Good question! Okay, there's some weird stuff going on with Dr. Crossing's spray here. Yeah. I don't think that's hitting him. Remember the rule whatever his weakness is will be the thing that's hardest to hit him with. Uh, the ground is weird because uh, Dr. Kosick is actually the background that is being moved and the, the platforms are spikes. Oh, garbage! Oh, wow, it hits him even when it's not. Mm. Oh, garbage, my garbage. <laughs> I'm dead. That's fine, though. Because, no, it's not, actually. It's actually not fine. Wow, yeah, that checkpoint was way back, wasn't it? Yep. Take time. Yep. This, I really hate it when Mega Man games don't give you reusable checkpoints. Yeah. Like, come on. Don't waste the player's time. Ah! Well, you've been craned game. I've been craned! I, cra I craned my whole life for this, Aura. Okay, this is maybe not the weakness. Maybe there's something better. What? What? I'll crane the crane! Oh, counter crane! Wait, Mega Man, wait! Let me do it! <laughs> Remember our trip in Jakarta? <laughs> At that time we eat carrot off with my father together. Aww! Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, that's fair. Oh, Kalinka. Forgive me! 
All right. <laughs> Did I bra waggle time? We. I'm gonna miss that. Hey, actual Wily Castle with a giant, like. You have the entrance, you have the second entrance right next to the first one and you didn't even plow it. Like, people are just gonna have to like, get snow boots to get this. It's, just, it's awkward. You didn't, you left the door, you left both doors open. Wily, you're not even trying. <laughs> right. Well, that's it for today. Thank you so much, everybody. This has been a ride. Ah, <laughs> uh, thank you, Aura, for being there. Ah, thank you so much for the cheers, and the raids, and the subs, and just being there really means a lot to me. Hope you have a good day. See you next time. I don't know when that'll be, but it'll be soon, and then Aura's gonna order some food, because we're hungry. Ooh. Food! Ooh. Thank you for watching. Please take care of you, because you're worth it. And you deserve it. Let's keep making wonderful things together. Bye-bye!